What's going on guys, Keaton here from TechSmart and today I'm going to be unboxing the brand new Google Glass Explorer Edition that I picked up in New York City. I had to haul all the way out to New York, so let's go ahead and take a look. So within the elegant looking bag itself, you receive the Google Glass Explorer Edition, the shields and the shades. The shades are the sunglass frame that easily slide in and the shields are a clear frame. So this particular color is cotton, codenamed for white. I really like this color, it suits all my outfits and really just looks sleek while giving off the sexiness appeal that it touts. So everyone is eager, so let's go ahead and unbox this bad boy. The box construction is phenomenal, and it's the best I've ever seen in a product. Then we are greeted with the Google Glass Cotton Edition. On the box, it has a few instructions, which are very simple and quite elegant. So the instructions are very easy to go ahead and comprehend and physically get the device on. So yes, I had to get this device physically fitted on my face, kind of a unique concept there in New York, so it has been pre-opened. So once the new technology is unleashed from its box, we have a few dots on here telling us what they are. We have listen, on and off, touch, capture and see, which is the screen. Once lifting up the cardboard insert, we are greeted with glasses carrying case, which is made out of a few unique materials. It is constructed out of Japanese microfiber in which, in perspective, no one really ever knew the difference in my opinion here. Obviously it's high quality and some other components also feature this same material. So after taking the hard shell carrying case out, we are greeted with a few other goodies. We have the literature pack, and this is something I kind of like, and it's one of my favorite components, at, uh, setting aside the device itself. We have the frequently asked questions guide. It's very helpful, and they answer a lot of questions that users might have about the device as it is so foreign. They have a, you are a pioneer, and it's really just a thank you to adopting this product. And then we have some nose pads for total comfort. So again, sticking with the literature here, it says you are a pioneer, a founder, an architect of what's possible. You are a glass explorer. Explorer. This just makes it feel all warm and gooey inside, and you can actually see this with their Glass Explorer helpline. It's for Glass Explorers only, but you can just see how passionate the people are, and that's something I really enjoy about this product. And then for the final components within the Google Glass box, we have the flat micro USB cable, and I think these are really cool and they're color coded, and I'll also drop a link in the description below if you want to go pick one up. They're super cheap, and then we have the standard glass wall adapter. So now we're on to the big bad boy of the show. We have the Google Glass Explorer Edition in cotton. It looks absolutely phenomenal. At the top, we have our camera button. We have the five megapixel camera sensor followed by 720p video. We have the plastic screen, which surprisingly looks great. Then we have the power button followed by a button-like thing that says glass on it, but is actually the bone conduction which makes noise within your head. Really cool technology. Then we're on to the construction of glass. There are titanium nose pieces there which really you can go ahead and customize to fit your nose. It's supposed to match your brow. Then we have a titanium band which is very flexible and can mold to lots of different heads. So last but not least, we have the glass screen, which is movable, so you can adjust it to your field of vision. And finally, we have the trackpad, which enables you to control the physical unit. It's very sensitive and works very well. So overall, I'm really impressed with Google Glass. The main reason why I invested within this technology, yes, it was $1,500, is I believe that this is the future. People have been saying this is the future, wearables are the next big thing, and that's one thing I've truly preached, and I think this will be a way for us to go ahead and shop, get directions to a new extent besides Google Maps, and just a lot of great things that we are unable to do with our current smartphones now. So what do you think of Google Glass? Is this something you'd buy? Is this something you're going to reject? If the price is right, will you pick one up as soon as possible? Let me know what you have to say in the comments section down below. Also, please be sure to kick the shiitake mushrooms out of that like button as I traveled all the way to New York to go and pick up this unit. Thank you guys so much again, and be sure to stay tuned for more Google Glass content. Thanks, bye bye